APCG Development and Solidarity Network has alleged that some cabals are desperately out to procure a court injunction against the APC Caretaker Extraordinary Convention Planning Committee under Governor Mimala Buni. The group said a whooping 5 billion naira has been a mark for the purpose. Speaking at the press conference in Abuja, the group led by Tobias Hogbe said the plan is aimed at causing an uprising within the APC and the country at large in pursuit of an ambition built on deceit and the quest for power through the back door. We wish to inform all APC stakeholders and members of the general public that part of the new plot is to secure a court judgment through the back door that will sack the party's leadership from office. The scheme, which is heavily funded by a serving minister and presidential aspirant for the South side, has earmarked close to 5 billion naira for this purpose. We have it on our own reliable information that, from our credible source, 5 billion naira has been earmarked to execute this plot. We wish to inform members of the public as well as the security agencies that the sum of 2.5 billion naira has been earmarked as payment for the lawyers that will initiate the process as well as reaching out to the willing judge who would in turn be rewarded with the same sum of 2.5 million naira. The plan is for the judge to give an induction against the chairman of the Ketika Extraordinary Convention Planning Committee that will pave the way for a change in the party's leadership to the back door. The general public must be aware of this despicable plot, hence this press conference, to raise public awareness of the plot undermine the efforts made by the Mala Buni leadership of the APC. We want to use this medium to send a note of warning to judges and justice in the legal profession to refuse to be used as pounds to truncate the democratic, the democratic process in Nigeria. The implication of allowing themselves to be used by some APC governors indeed potents grave danger for the sustenance of democracy in Nigeria. However, we are confident in the judiciary integrity to stand for justice and equity. We thank you all for your time.